Hi, I'm Dr. Jan Dutz. I'm a scientist at the Arthritis Research Center of Canada. I'm also a dermatologist and a rheumatologist and professor of dermatology and skin science at the University of British Columbia. Psoriasis is a flaky skin disease uh, and approximately 30% of patients with psoriasis are at risk of developing psoriatic arthritis, which can be quite a debilitating joint disease. We're interested in studying psoriasis because we're interested in identifying the people that are at risk of developing psoriatic arthritis. If we can identify those people early, we can begin treatment early and maybe even prevent the development of the arthritis. We knew that obesity could lead to psoriasis and that obesity could lead to rheumatoid arthritis. What we didn't know was the relationship between obesity and psoriatic arthritis. What we found was that 18% of the general public was obese, 30% of patients with psoriasis were obese, but 40% of patients with psoriatic arthritis were obese. We used to think that patients with psoriasis and psoriatic arthritis were overweight at least in part because they did not feel well enough to exercise. We now have extraordinarily effective treatments for psoriasis, the skin disease, and psoriatic arthritis, the joint disease. What we found is that despite these patients feeling better, their weight have, has not decreased. Why this is is not exactly clear. However, it gives us an opportunity to counsel patients uh, on the importance of losing weight and exercising now that they feel better. We know that maintaining a healthy weight is important for general health. We now know that weight control is particularly important for patients with psoriasis and psoriatic arthritis.